Hey, good morning. Uh, doing a little driving to a meeting this morning, but I uh, just wanted to go over exactly what I mean when people have a lot of equity inside their house, but they just sometimes they just can't get out of their own way and, and think about the bigger picture. So let me explain. Um, I was talking to a lady yesterday. She was around 70 years old and she wanted to increase her cash flow because her income has really dropped down. Good morning, Rebecca. And really, really dropped down. So, but she was just, she was so focused on her interest rate. Now, let me just say this. If you have uh, an interest rate or a loan that you got within the last four or five years or so, okay, and you're just so focused on that part and not looking at the bigger financial picture, then it doesn't make any sense to, to, to try to refinance. But here, here's the reality of it. We deal with a lot of other things in our lives as far as expenses, as far as cash flow, as far as what to buy, and so forth. So when I tried to explain that to her, and you know, she had a lot of debt, I said, look, we can pay off three credit cards here. We can chop this down. We can save you $650 a month. We can apply it here. We can apply it there. She could not understand why her interest rate was going to be higher now than when she locked it in about, let's say, you know, two years ago. And it was about the same. It wasn't that much higher. I was like, look, by paying off this stuff, you can cut your mortgage down to a 14-year mortgage now, or you can apply the 650 over here, pay off this debt sooner, increase your cash flow even more. We can get to $1,000 a month. So when it comes to refinance, get out of your head that the main thing is to think about the interest rate that you have now, okay? Interest rates have gone up. They will continue to go up with inflation until we get that reined in. Inflation is the arch enemy of bonds, which is tied to rates. So that's a fact. Now, does, does that mean that you should not refinance? Of course not. If you can increase your cash flow um, and, and pay off some debt, that's one. Or if you can cut down your term, even with a higher interest rate, and still have a lower payment. I know that a lot of times people can't understand that, but your balances have changed. And, and now we can slice off 10 years off your mortgage or five years off your mortgage and save thousands upon thousands of dollars long term. Then it makes sense. If you're looking to take cash out and still cut the term down and, and still have it within your budget, but now you have all this cash because whether you have uh, kids going to college, whether you have other debts to pay off, whatever, then it makes sense. There's 10 to 15 things where it makes sense where interest rate doesn't even come into play the interest rate that you have now. But most people cannot get out of their own way and understand that. And, and by, by looking at that, and that's why we do a lot of videos and we do screen captures and we send it to our clients and we walk them through Hey, listen, if you do this, this, and this, this is how much you save short term, this is how much you save long term, and this is how you can apply it. But you gotta get your mind right if you really wanna you know, increase cash flow and you're so focused on the interest rate because now the rates are different than they were, say, a few years ago. So anyway, I just wanted to throw that out there and understand that when you're looking to do a refinance, interest rates down the list of what you have now what is the whole situation how can we increase your cash flow how can we get you know increase your wealth impact and you know it's it's very important to understand that and and be shown that that's why we do that we walk you through visuals on that uh to to you know don't be so concerned about well i got the small interest rate now and, and then you know that's it you know i, I can't do anything meanwhile you've got 50 75 150 thousand dollars of equity in there that you can tap into it smartly and apply some of that uh to increase your cash flow and wealth impact and, and even cut the term down even more so uh please understand if you any questions comment down below shoot me a private message or text me at 423-262-9229 i'll talk to you soon